Arsenal have been top gunners in the Premier League all season. But flip the script, it's April, and it looks like the North London club are setting up the stage for a colossal title race, with perennial title chasers City hot on their trail. After a hapless 4-1 loss to Manchester City in the Premier League, and with two points ahead of the Manchester team, we have the perfect excuse to talk about the five greatest title races in Premier League history. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell icon to be notified of our latest videos. Ready? Let's go! We're sure Manchester United fans are still feeling the sting from this one today, and if a football season should ever be made into a movie, it is surely this one. In the 2011-2012 season, both Manchester clubs, Manchester United and City, were having a title race for the ages. They started the season well, and when both teams met in October, City's 6-1 dissemination of United laid down a marker for a tumultuous season ahead as they led other teams till March. As it's been for years under Sir Alex Ferguson, Manchester United steered the rocky ship after the defeat to their noisy neighbours and were back in prime form. With Wayne Rooney in prime form, they racked up a series of impressive victories and were a good eight points ahead of second place City going into the final six games. As it is in football, everything's not always like it seems, and a string of draws saw Manchester City come level on points, and only needing to draw with QPR to win the title. But like a scene from a movie, and with a brilliantly written script, City found themselves 2-1 down as Manchester United waited for news from the Etihad after a routine win against Sunderland. Then of course we had an epic City fight back, and the Aguero moment seeing City win the title with seconds to go, and lifting the trophy for the first time in over 40 years. While the dramatic United City title race was a drama field, the City-Liverpool one was of sheer domination. Considering the sheer quality of Liverpool and Manchester City in the 2018-2019 season, it has to be one of the greatest title races in history. Both teams were near faultless all season, and for the first time in over three decades, it seemed like Liverpool could get their hands on the title if City lost to relegation threatened Brighton. Well, hate to break it to you, City thrashed Brighton and lifted the title despite Liverpool's best efforts against Wolves. Liverpool ended the season with 97 points, the most for any second-place team in history. While the title race in 2018-2019 was full of glamour and Rolls-Royce-like players, the 1995 one between Blackburn and Manchester United was the good old title dogfight. It's safe to say Blackburn's glory days are past them these days, but in the 90s, they were proper good. The Rovers were runners-up the season before and faced stiff challenge from defending champions Manchester United who were looking to defend their title. And as you'd expect, the title race pretty much went down to the wire as Blackburn Rovers were only two points ahead of United. On the last day, the Rovers lost to Liverpool, but United fluffed their lines and drew 1-1 against West Ham, meaning Rovers won their first title in over 80 years. While Blackburn's story in the 1995 season had a happy ending, Liverpool's story in 2013-2014 season didn't. In the 2013-2014 Premier League season, Liverpool, Chelsea and Manchester City were all frontrunners in the title race. Liverpool under Brendan Rodgers were having the time of their lives, Manuel Pellegrini's Manchester City was gliding to victory and Jose Mourinho's Chelsea were, oh well, party spoilers. Given their form, Liverpool were bang on favourites to win the title. With a lethal combination of Daniel Sturridge and Luis Suarez firing at all cylinders, they could not be stopped. They'd racked up 11 straight victories and were table toppers by April. When it seemed like Liverpool was starting to stumble over the line, there was Steven Gerrard with his famous quote, we do not let this slip, we go again, to, you know, reinforce the team, or so you'd think. All was going well for Liverpool, till Chelsea came visiting to Anfield and Gerrard Slip gave a gift of a goal away to Den Bar, who gracefully scored. Liverpool would go on to have a full-on title collapse and gift Manchester City the title later on. They'd have to wait a couple more years to get their hands on the title once more. In the 2002-2003 season, Arsenal were building a dynasty and looked to compete with the biggest boys in town, Manchester United. Arsenal had an eight-point lead in March, but they managed to lose 12 points in their final nine games, 
which allowed Manchester United to swoop in for the title. It's a kind of Arsenal attitude we've all come to know and love these days. So that's been it, friends. Do you think the title race this season will go down to the wire? Let us know in the comments section. While you do that, check out the greatest Premier League title collapses in this video and subscribe so you get the first ring once we have a new video. We'll catch you next time. Peace out.